Good evening, I'm Adam Pinsker. Plans to move forward on replacing Bloomington's 4th Street garage is delayed until at least August. Juan Carlos Carasquel of Juan Sells Realty owns the property the city is trying to acquire through eminent domain. He told the Planning Commission the petition is illegal since he hasn't given permission for the city to build on his land. A minute ago, you heard the city saying, oh, this is in a special circumstance. Oh, so, okay, the rules apply for us, and there's another set of rules to apply to the city. Is that what it is? The design calls for 510 parking spots and just over 11,000 square feet of retail space. People poured into the Candles Holocaust Museum and Education Center today in Terre Haute to remember founder and survivor Eva Kaur. Kaur and her twin sister were the only members of her immediate family that survived after being sent to Auschwitz concentration camp in 1944. It's just really a, a time to come and to be and to reflect. We have some papers for you to fill out and share your fondest memory of Eva. Um, at some point, we hope that they become an exhibit. The museum is planning a candle lighting ceremony for Saturday. While a funeral is planned for the family this weekend, there will be a public memorial in August. Former Indiana State Health Commissioner Woody Myers is set to announce Wednesday that he is running for governor. He would be the first Democrat to officially declare their candidacy. Myers served as state health commissioner three decades ago and made a run for Congress in 2008. Your weather forecast for the rest of tonight will see a low of 68 under mostly clear skies. And for tomorrow, about a 40% chance of rain with a high of 90, a bit cooler on Thursday with a high of 85 and the heat returns in time for your weekend. Have a great night.